this. Well done, Rangers. Now all that's left is to show it in the chapel. The time of reform is at hand. Tell me what you did with my papers, you treacherous bitch, or I'll dig your eyes out. I don't care what you do to me, adulterer. I hope you rot in hell. If I do, you'll be there with me, you c- I'll- I have your papers, Mayweather! And having seen them, I'm declaring you unfit to lead the Salvation Church. You are a monster. Give me those papers, Confessor McDade, or I'll take them off your dead body. You're welcome to try, hypocrite. Now, friends, let us end this tyranny. Rangers, kill these peasants and I'll make it very much worth your while. Oh. Uh, thank you, Confessor McDade. You have cleansed the church of corruption and freed me from a sham marriage. I owe you my life. I, Confessor McDade, what in God's name have you done? Only as God bade me, Shepherd. Look at this. Look at what the evangelist Mayweather has been hiding from us. Great God Almighty, I thought something like this was going on, but I had no idea it had gone that far. Yes, it's horrifying, and I do not know how far the corruption has spread. But I intend to find out by taking over as head of the church and leading an internal investigation before returning to our mission. Now, will you aid me in this, Shepherd, or would you like to be first put to the question? <laughs> I, I, of course, I'll help, Confessor McDade. The church militant has always looked for, to the church vigilant for guidance, and I don't see why that should change. You can count on me as you move the Salvation Church forward into the future, I swear it. Okay. Congratulations, Echo One. Also, skills. Six skill points. Um, yeah. Energy weapons. Thirteen skill points. So we want brute force. Yeah. Okay, what does the log say? Um, do I have to resolve this one? Just the resolved was... With malediction that there is no need to continue. We shared the evidence against, evidence against malediction to McDade. He was disgusted but didn't seem the least bit surprised. He invites us to be there when he confronts Mayweather. Okay. Game saved. Attention McDade. As McDade holds gestures with his hands, you notice what looks like the long healed scars of old rope burns half hidden under his cuffs. Either he was a prisoner himself at one point, or he's into some pretty kinking stuff. Hmm. Please, take this small token of my appreciation. Thank you again, Rangers. Tell me about the, the broken man. <laughs> how? How do you know the name? Have you threatened her? Hurt her? If you've touched a single hair on her head, I'll... Oh god, I've betrayed myself, haven't I? Well, job well done, Rangers. I don't know who you work for. Jones, maybe. It doesn't matter. You can tell him I have indeed sinned against the church, and I will accept whatever punishment they meet out. It cannot be worse than that which I have been contemplating for myself. You should return to Veronica. It has ruined me. I can no longer do my job. How can I root out sinners when I no longer know what sin is? I used to believe that all within the militia were by definition without sin, and all outside it were tainted, but Veronica has shown me that virtue is not exclusive to the faithful, while my fellows in the militia have proved that sin is not exclusive to the heathens. I don't know what to do. I've contemplated leaving the church and going to find her, but I'm afraid she would reject me knowing what I truly am. Listen, would you tell her? I know a brave man would do this himself, but I could not bear to stand before her if she hated me. If she will have me as I am, tell me, and I will go see her. Yes, sir. Thank you, Range. I know it's more than I should ask, and I am grateful. I await your return with fear and hope. Oh. Also, can we loot this guy? Yeah, we can! Sweet. Um, spares 12. Bastion, radio tower, gate key. And um, this, I think... Check who's... 
we can keep that one. So, character, he's got nine. Ah, uh, she's got nine. He's got ten already. This can go to her. Because she does have conductive armor. Spares twelve. I wonder if I should start, um, let me see what uh, we can get if we if we disband it. UMP, if we've got better. Okay. Strip, no. strip the parts. Mod choke. Full choke weapon parts. Or Laser sight, flash suppressor, quick mag, long barrel, high capacity mag, sturdy mag, junk weapon bolts. Only one I can think of is the laser sight. I think that's an under barrel. Nope. Stripper bolts. Nope. Nope. Okay. Um. Hmm. Distribution gems. I run the promotion. Cool. Congratulations, Echo One. Yes, um, character skills. Five skill points. Combat shooting, smart as weapon smithing. Ah, sorry, this character. Um, SMG, a blunt weapon. Yeah. And this guy we're still waiting for. A few more points. I think we can go this way. Secret entrance. Gonna speak to Veronica. You know, get a happy ending over here. <laughs> to this, a love story, a drama. You can carry over a small amount of action points for a character's next combat turn. Okay. So we did that without uh, starting a assault on the paladins. I think was important because as we saw once we did that um, all of them turned hostile okay quick save I think, yeah, we didn't um, do the snitching bit. <laughs> Welcome to the dungeon! Mistress Veronica. Did you find my broken man, Rangers? It's Ascension McDade. He's... He's Ascension McDade? Are you? Sure? Oh god, how can this be? How can I have fallen in love with one of those hate mongers? He loves you. He, he said that? I, I don't know what to say. I knew he was tortured. A guild not even the most brutal scourging could not free from free him from and and now I guess I know why. I don't know, I don't know. It seems impossible that I could accept someone who does not who does what he does, but but if he, a man of the church, can accept someone who does what I do, then who am I to be unbending? If you will have me as I am, then I will have him as he is. Oh I didn't dare to hope. Beloved, you came to me. Have have you left the church? Ah, oh, look at him. <laughs> If that's what you want, but as these rangers know, I've been working to change it from within, trying to guide it with the principles you have awakened in me. I want to make the church a weapon against truth and against tyranny, slavery and injustice. I want to make it something you would be proud of to be connected with. It's hard to believe so fanatical an organization could change so much, but if you believe it, then I will. Oh, but wait, Heidi is planning to attack Bastion as we speak. Your plan may never have a chance to succeed. Rangers, listen to me. 
As much as I've hated the militia, I've hated the idea of war more. And now Ascension has given us a way to stop it. With him in power, the church will change and Heidi will have no need to attack. Can you go to her? Please, plead with her. She... No, forget it. I can't fool myself. She won't listen. She's as hidebound as the militia. She wants this war as much as they do. I'm sorry, Ascension. It's hopeless. I'm afraid there's nothing I can do. You can do what I'm doing. I can't convince my leaders to change, so I'm forced to become a leader myself. Me? Become a, the leader of Hollywood? Ha! Huh, Heidi rules the council. No one would turn against her. Haven't you told me that they've all asked her for help and she refused? That she's been so focused on war that she's putting off everything else? What if you promised them that peace would solve all their problems? Rangers, please, I can't do this. Heidi would suspect something, but if you act as my, acted as my emissary, it might work. Go to the five HCC members and ask what it would take to get them to vote Heidi out of office and vote me in. Once you've secured their votes, come back and we'll go to the next HCC meeting. We'll need at least four votes to get a majority. Will you help? The hope of peace is in your hands. Yes, we'll do. Thank you, Rangers. Thank you. Now the HCC rules are clear. A simple majority can vote out the incumbent chairperson, so return as soon as you have as you are certain of at least four votes and if you find it hard to convince any of the HCC members to vote against Heidi, let me know. I may be able to think of something. Goodbye darling. I need to return to the bastion to lay the groundwork for peace. <laughs> How many people do you need to vote for you again? You need at least three to win a majority but would need one secure would only sec but more would only secure my position. Hmm, do you think we could make some posters? No, sorry, getting carried away. Right. Until we meet again, Rangers. Ooh. There's a coup happening right under her nose. Mary. So, I think we start over here. Do we have a log of that? Um, gather votes for Veronica. At least the three members of the HCC. I think this one count. George Lynn. Thanks for clearing out the shop, Rangers. Will you vote for Veronica at the next HEC meeting? Since you cleaned out her shop, I guess I can vote for Veronica. Trade. What do That's you have to trade, trade? My friend. Um. Oh, it's expensive. Ah, oh, but it's for a full stack. Uh, sell junk. I keep forgetting that it's for the full stack. See you, Rangers. Finally, something natural in this unnatural town. Okay. So my uh, guy is a bit of a fool. Daniel has given 45 piles of broken weapon pods to Takayuki. Um, and that's one. I think Ma Brown will count as well. Maybe a Rambo? Flo. It's got a new business, even though it's called, still called Shrag. Hi then, just good to see you again. Your name is yours. Will you vote for Veronica at the next HCC meeting? You want me to vote for Heidi out of the HCC? Well, if you say so, I'll do it. I owe you rangers everything. Giving you the vote you want is the least I can do in return. You can count on me. Ooh. So, Flo didn't hesitate. We helped George and Mark clear out their shop. They agreed to vote for Veronica. Mar Brown, maybe? Copy, Rangers Team Echo. Report, Echo promotion. One, one. Congratulations, Echo One. You've done well. Thank you, sir. Echo One out. What do you have? Oh. Oh! So many points! Um.
I get the last point in barter. Yeah, this is that. Then, yeah, we have 10, 10, 10. Hmm. Maybe brawling? <laughs> um, wait, yeah, more brown. Let's try that. She still. Does she count? Come to help me protest. Okay. Oh man, now I'm missing my mom's cooking. <laughs> Rumors from Hollywood say that the Rangers wiped out the slavery. Um, ha. Rambos? They may have killed the slavery, but only to replace them. Lock Game up. saved. Ah. Uh. Bienvenue, Rangers. Will you vote for Renaka at the next HCC meeting? You want Rambo to vote against Madame Heidi? No, he will not do it. Heidi is a good woman, a strong ah. leader. She saved Hollywood. Why would he do this thing? I think this answer won't help him. <laughs> Veronica will make peace between Hollywood and the Bastion. Hmm. Is true. With the peace, Rambo could sell his guns to the priests without shooting himself in the foot, yes? Uh, but no, it could be nothing but talk. If you wish Rambo to support Madame Veronica, he must see what she can do, no? Voila! I have it. Someone has been stealing Rambo's guns. Very tricky. No break-in, no damage. The guns, they just vanish. If you find the thief and Rambo's guns, I will vote for Madame Veronica. But not before, yes? Okay. Try be in. You just bring the thief to Rambo. He will know how to deal with him. Now go. Au revoir. Adieu, mes amis. Hey, Rambo, I'm going to check with HSP on their next delivery. See ya. Hmm. Let's follow that guy. Sounds suspicious. Ooh, synth. Come for the gun, and Jason. Okay, let's start this. Can't really no good. What? Interesting ranges. Whoa, where did you guys come from? No matter, they are top priority kill order. <laughs> die, human, die. Whoa, that's a mean guy. Now, in there. We've got top priority kill order on machines as well. Scratch him. 244. Damage chassis. Crouch. Enter. Jackhammer. Eye on a beamer. Crouch. Yeah. My guy's got uh, been preparing for a while for this uh, types, of, types of fights. Uh, out of range. Okay. Who's this guy? Uh, uh, thanks. Guess I'll be on my way then. What about come with us? Oh man, come on, I'll make it worth your while, let me go! What about, come now? 
Fine, fine, you can let me, I'll come with you. <laughs> Just loot. Send a shell. Ooh. Rambo. Jason, what is the meaning of this? Jason is the one who's been stealing from you. Jason, not Rambo's apprentice. Kill a tragedy. Kill a trustees. Rambo strikes Jason, causing 214 points of damage, blasting him into chunks of steaming meat. Life goes on, no? Rambo thanks you for catching the thief, and he will keep his word. He will vote for Madame Veronica. Au revoir. What do you have? Sweet. Oh. Certainly. So he's got he the good stuff, man. Rambo's he's selection. got the good stuff. So this is the one that we were still uh, missing. In terms of uh, upgrade. PSG, that's the one we've got. I oh, know we've got a bigger one. Much bigger! Um, oh, so much good stuff. Uh, let's get that for Rose. Goodbye. And swap that up. Fifty six damage per AP. And we can sell that. Okay, sell that. Trade. Certainly. Sell. Please enjoy Rambo's selection. And this. Sell junk. I'm not sure about the broken weapon parts, whether we're gonna get um, any of our uh, regular people back into our base to sell those to. Hmm. Got all these grenades. I guess some of them to Takayuki. All of them to Takayuki. <laughs> um. Then, he's got armor. He's got space for this. And we want this as well on some of them. So she can get spectrum armor. He's got serious sh shit in the armor. So we need two more. Rose can get it. She needs it. So three more armor pieces. Goodbye. So he needs better armor. Pistol Pete needs better. Armor. Ah, we got the one from the Paladins, which we reverted the fight. Can maybe check if they're more friendly. Probably not. Um, so she got some. That's got upgrade space. That's got upgrade space. That's got upgrade space. So they got two on ten. We want this guy to go up to seven. This to up up to seven. She's up to seven. He's up to ten. And there's up to seven as well. Okay. However, I'm gonna save the game there for tonight. Great. Uh, thanks for hanging out this evening. Uh, I will be back tomorrow at about half past one, two ish uh, for No Man's Sky. 
Um, so I'm going to play No Man's Sky on the weekend, and then next Monday evening uh, I'll be back to Wasteland 2 again at half past seven UK time. Hope to see you then. Take care. Bye bye.